Welcome to my presentation. In this presentation, we shall see some simple examples related to transpose of a matrix. In this example, we want to say if we want to show if A is a matrix which has which is a two by two uh, matrix one two three four. I'm taking a simple example just to illustrate the point. And if B is another matrix and it is also a 2 by 2 matrix and if the and the elements of those are 5 6 7 and 8 like that then we want to show we want to show the product of ab if we take if we find the product of ab and then transpose it is that the same as b transpose times a transpose We'll find out. Okay, so that is what we want to see if that is true or not true. So we will first find the product AB, and how do we do that? To find that, we're going to write this one out in this manner: one, two, three, four. We take the first matrix. We want to multiply it to the second matrix: five, six, seven, eight. And when we do that, this is what we get. 1 times 5 is 5, 2 times 7 is 14, 1 times 6 is 6, and then 2 times 8 is 16, 3 times 5 is 15, and then 4 times 7 is 28. Okay, then 3 times 6 is 18, and then 4 times 8 is 32. So when we simplify this some more, we get 5 plus 14 is 19, 6 plus 16 is 22, 15 plus 28 is 43, right? 8 plus 5 is uh, 13, 2, 3, 4, 43, yes. And then 18 plus 32 is 50. So the product of AB is 19, 22, 43, and 50. But we want, if we were to transpose this, how do we transpose this? We're going to write the rows as columns. We're going to write these rows as columns. And therefore, we can write this as 19, 22, 43, and 50. So this is the matrix. So, product of AB and then transpose of that is this matrix here. Okay, so let me, this is equal to. I'm going to put a red box on that. Then we will come back and then see if we can do the second part of the problem. The second part of the problem is if we, if we know the, we know uh, if B is the matrix given to us. Let me write that in this black ink. If B is matrix 5, 6, 7, 8, the transpose of this matrix is going to be as follows. B transpose is going to be equal to 5, 6, 7, 8, like that. And then if A is a matrix which is given to us as 1, 2, 3, 4 and then A transpose is going to be we're going to write the rows as columns 1, 2, 3, 4 like that. So if we were to take these two and multiply them out we want to see whether that matches with what we have uh, in what we have uh, as product AB and then transpose of that. So we want to find out B transpose times A transpose. We found out B transpose as being equal to 5, 7, 6, 8, like that. And then we go to take that and then multiply it to A transpose, which is 1, 3, 2, 4, like that. So when we start the multiplication process, 1 times 5 is 5, plus 
2 times 7 is 14. 5 times 3 is 15 and then 7 times 4 is 28. 6 times 1 is 6 plus 8 times 2 is 16. 6 times 3 is 18 plus 8 times 4 is 24. 8 times 4 is, sorry, 32. 8 times 4 is 32. Now when we simplify this, it's going to be 4 plus, uh, 5 plus 14 is 19. And then 15 plus 28 is 43. 6 plus 16 is 22. And then 18 plus 32 is 50. So B transpose A transpose is equal to that. So if we were to come back and then look at, let me put a red box on this here. And as you can see, um, a, uh, a, B, the product of A, B and the transpose of that is same as, same as the values the, is the same. The matrix is the same as B transpose A transpose. So therefore we can come back in here and say if we were to multiply uh, matrix A times matrix B and then transpose that, that is the same as B transpose times A transpose. Okay, so that is one thing to keep in mind. So in my next presentation, we shall look at some more examples related to transpose of a matrix.